Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Pop Culturally Challenged. My name is David. This is my beautiful wife, Tony. Hello. And tonight we are going to be watching The Fifth Element. What do you know about it? <laughs> <laughs> um, you said it was a uh, sci-fi movie, mm -hmm. but that's all I know. Okay. Yeah, I uh, I have not seen this either. This is one that I remember when it came out. I was in my last year of college, and I was working two jobs, and uh, I had, like, more than full-time course loads, so I had, like, no free time. I was not going to the movies. My was, <laughs> The only thing I was trying to do was finish college so I could be done. So... This was always one of those movies that I was going to go back and watch. And, you know, yeah, I want to see that someday. And I don't know how I just never got around to seeing it. Hmm. So I know Bruce Willis is in it. Uh, I I know it's sci-fi. I think it takes place in the future. I'm assuming because all the posters have, like, flying cars. Hmm. But I don't know if it's, like, some alternate future or another planet. I don't even know if it takes place on Earth. So hmm. uh, it should be interesting. We. You know, one that neither of us have seen. Sure. I don't know if it's sad, scary. I have no idea. I don't know if it's a comedy or what. Well, isn't sci-fi usually scary? Yeah, but I'm guessing it's sci-fi just because it looks like it's futuristic and oh. that kind of stuff. So I'm assuming it's sci-fi, but who knows? This could be a, a romantic comedy for all I know. <laughs> I, I just really have no idea. Well, so. I haven't even seen the movie poster or the um, artwork or anything, so okay. who knows? All right. Well, you ready to get started? I am. All right. Well, if you guys enjoy this reaction, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, comment down below. Let us know what you thought of The Fifth Element. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And if you would like to see the full-length reaction to this and everything else that we've reacted to, I'll put a link to our Patreon down below. And on that note, on with the show. That feels old. Yeah, that logo is from when we were kids. Okay, it's not that old. Yes, it is. <laughs> no. Okay, so I know everybody calls me old, so, you well, know. Actually, this film's from 1997, so it's not even like... We weren't even kids anymore. That's kind of a weird sound. Mm -hmm. I feel like they're in a, in a ship of some sort. Yeah. It's a ship. Is this like an Independence Day or something? Where they're going to come down to wipe out humanity or something? Mm -hmm. I, mean, I, I thought like Utah or something when I saw mm -hmm. that. Not Egypt. 1914. What's happening? Mm -hmm. You brought lunch? When the three planets are in eclipse, evil comes. He's a snake, really. Ultimate evil. Make sure you get the snake. Yes, I've got your snake. So when is this snake act supposed to occur? Every 5,000 years. So I've got some time. <laughs> Poor kid. Dad. <gasps> ah, I will take it to the master with God to be safe from evil. Gathering together the four elements of life. Water, fire, earth, air. How does he know that? He's just really smart. Okay, be Lord. You already know too much. Father, I'm so glad to see you. It's the most extraordinary thing. Yes, you must be parched. Like a battle. <laughs> Let us toast your pain. You can't drink a toast with water. Really. You're gonna have to do it the old fashioned way and just like stab him or something. <laughs> oh no. Why is it closing? Looks like a bee stinger, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Like, kind of feel like they're not gonna live to tell the tale anyway. Why aren't they saying anything? Aziz, right? Thank you. Nobody, like, why isn't he saying anything? Right? He sees them, right? Yeah, I, I'm guessing so. What the heck are these things? <laughs> Odd light placement. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say they have wee wees, but. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't think I'd be worried about drawing them right now. 
pretty big. Yeah, but they look like they're just plodding along. I mean, can't you get out of there? You could probably outrun them. They look like the fastest creatures. <gasps> Are you German? German. <laughs> but there is no worry. I was there in time. Stones not safe on Earth anymore. What stones? Oh. The element stones, I guess. What is he gonna do with the gun? My lord, if you take the weapon, we will be defenseless. In 300 years, when evil returns, so shall we. Okay, so 2214, they're gonna come back? The evil's gonna be here? Don't move! They got our friends. Friends? They killed the professor. Please, put the gun down. Billy, go! Pass your knowledge to the next priest as it was passed on to you. It's only life important. I will fulfill my mission! I will pass the knowledge of the only God! Well, they're not going to come back for another 300 years. He's not going to be alive. Okay, 300 years later. That doesn't look good. Oh my gosh. Send out a probe. I saved the seat for you, Father. A Devo hat? <laughs> Those little lines on the belt. So, what you say is you don't know what this is. Not yet, sir. Recommendation? My philosophy, Mr. President, is shoot first and ask questions later. Mr. President. Please, Vito Cornelius, expert of astral phenomena. I have a different theory. Yeah, 20 seconds. You've already lost five. Yeah. Shooting will only make it stronger. I think the president was a wrestler. General, you may fire one loading of a 120ZR missile. Mark a light from the objective. Oh no. No, you made him mad. Better. Yes, sir. I have a doubt. I don't, Mr. President. <gasps> so they just shoot? Yeah. Did you destroy it? I'm about to, sir. <laughs> I'm about to. Do you have a screen that works, son? What, what do we have that's bigger than 240? Nothing, sir. Hear me, Senator. Get out there. Can you hear <gasps> Oh my god, he's bleeding. <gasps> it's a weird dream. If it was a dream. It looks like a set of something from Star Wars or something. I feel like he hasn't changed much. It's strange to see him with hair there. Man, I want a bed like that. Oh yeah, I forgot. I still prefer your cat to the real thing. There's a million women out there. Just want one. Perfect one. Don't exist, Major. I was gonna say, I don't think there is. Sure there is. I found her. No, because I overspend, remember? Oh, yeah, that is a problem. <laughs> and you didn't laugh at airplanes, so... <laughs> Watch it all day, sweetie. Now rot your brain. That's the future, a little two-inch TV screen. They got that wrong. Is that a Z-140? Yeah. Hmm. What's with the hat? Loaded. Well, you have to, have to push that little yellow button to load it. <laughs> what is that on his head? Oh, it's oh, so it's when he looked out his out the door. It looks like the hallway. Oh. 
That's a very dangerous gun. You know, maybe you better let me hang on to this one for you, huh? <laughs> you got a collection of guns. What year is this? 2214. So, in 200 years? We yeah. still won't have flying cars. <laughs> Sir, there's a Mondo T1 spaceship at the frontier requesting permission to enter our territory. Give it permission. Thank you. Hey, they showed up. Mm hmm. Like a couple hours late, but you know. Ooh, 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 what is that? Those don't look friendly. No. And they're gonna think that it was um, the people that let them in? I doubt it. Oh no. They sent one ship. I was gonna say. Yeah, it looks like a grasshopper. Looks like a hand. Like part <laughs> of a hand. Yeah. Sounds like a freaking nature to me. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wow. That's something wrong with your eyes. <laughs> and skin. Yeah. This is a normal human DNA chain, okay? Don't you just love his haircut? Yeah. Almost like this being was engineered. See, it looks like a hand yeah, holding on yeah, to something. Yeah, it's a What are they gonna do? It's like a 3D printer or something? They're like using the genetics to regrow it or something? Yeah. Tissue processing. Oh, wow. Yeah. Reconstruction complete. Is it gonna look human? I'm assuming so. Told you. Perfect. Thermal damages. <gasps> Nothing solid? Unbreakable. If you want out? You're going to have to learn to develop those communication skills. Yeah, I'm sure that makes sense, sir. <laughs> so much for unbreakable. <laughs> she somehow got through that foil wall? <laughs> So maybe the taxi cab's going to pick her up? Maybe. This is the police. There's nowhere else to go. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I wish I was that fit. They didn't give her much of a costume, did they? <laughs> I kind of felt like those were the bands that they yeah. had put on. To yeah, but <laughs> I mean, for the actress, it's like, here, here's some uh, bandages to wear. Well, if I was as lean as her, I don't think I'd mind. <laughs> <laughs> it's a typical ba uh, bathing suit, you know? She has no file. Siloom light sticks hanging from their mirror. <laughs> Those are all futuristic looking. Whoa. She goes off. Oh, oh. crap. He doesn't look back to see what hit him. Wouldn't you? <laughs> he is looking back. He yeah, just now, needed, well, but wouldn't you to, be like, what the hell was that? He had to control his car first. I understand boom. Big yeah. boom. Yeah, boom. Oh. Bada boom. Bada boom. <gasps> oh no. You know, you're lucky you're not there. Looks like this is your ride. Oh, that's gonna be his perfect woman. I guess. I can't. Can you please open your passenger door? Yeah, yeah, sure. Thank you for your cooperation. Hey! Emergency! Emergency! They don't chase you after tomorrow, they don't chase you. Hang on. Oh, I only speak two words. Stay with your bad English. 
English, <laughs> <in> English. <laughs> Moves. Is he still moving? Yeah. How they're not hitting him is beyond me, but... <laughs> Looks like they hit him a lot, but... Yeah, his bulletproof cab. Yeah. She's got that hole, though, that she can fall out of. <laughs> yeah. How do they expect us to find anything in this shit? The light sticks. <laughs> I didn't, I missed the light sticks. Yeah, they're hanging from their mirror. You okay? Here you. Yeah, I'm uh, looking for a priest. The wedding's are one floor down, my son. Congratulations. Looking for a priest named Vito Cornelius. That's me. He's got a tattoo on this arm here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's not having a good day, is he? It was like a, but, 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 but it gently because this woman is mankind's most precious possession. She is perfect. perfect. <laughs> See, I give you a romance. Wake up. <laughs> is this going to be like um, Snow White? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> His prince? Her prince? I shouldn't have done that. I, I was wrong to kiss you. Where did she get that from? I don't know where she could possibly have had that hidden. <laughs> I, I drive a cab. This is me. Corbin Dowell. And you, uh, what is your name? Corbin? Shorter version, maybe? <laughs> a nickname? Yeah. Shorter name? Lilu. Lilu? Lilu, yeah. That's easier to remember. Thank you, Mr. Zalot, for all your help. Thank you so much. You've been so kind, but no. What kind of shirt is he wearing? What does Acto Gamut mean? Uh, not, uh, never without my permission. <laughs> I was on my way over to see you and a big fair fell in my lap. How big? Five nine. Blue eyes. Perfect. This uh perfect fair. She got a name. Lou. Lilo. Lilo. Then in our history. Wow, she ate a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Chicken left. <laughs> Holy <Jeez>. moly! <laughs> that's, that's crazy. Agnon, is that you? Take it off. Oh, that's oh. funny. That's live. What is Panel's that? adjustable for easy carrying. Oh. Good for riders and lefties. Titanium recharger. One shot. Mm -hmm. Replay <gasps> sends every following shot to the same location. Wow. Oh, that's funny. Rocket launcher. <laughs> Always fish and flamethrower. The all new Ice Cube system. I'm serious. More full crate. He's not impressed. <laughs> <laughs> Like, he needs to, everybody needs to hush. <laughs> Is it empty? This case is empty. The guardians uh, gave the stones to someone that they could trust. Supposed to contact this person in a hotel. She talks so fast. Yeah. Makes her so hard to understand, right? <laughs> Now, a real killer, when he picked up the ZF-1, would have immediately asked about the little red button on the bottom of the gun. This is Zorg. I'd like to talk to you. Zorg. You see, Father, by creating a little destruction, I'm in fact encouraging life. You and I are in the same business. 
What's going to happen with the cherry? Did it get stuck in his throat? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where's the robot to pat you on the back? <laughs> All kinds of crap in that desk, didn't he? <laughs> See now how all your so-called power counts for absolutely nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you, you saved my life, and in return I'll spare yours. You're a monster, dog. Talk to who you have to, the president. I don't care. Just bring me those stones. You have money. One hour? Yeah. Oh, I forgot about this thing. What thing? The big planet thing. Oh, yeah. Stones run aboard the ship. What do you mean? The Mondo Chua never fully trusted the human race. Her name is Papa Laguna. She's going to sing at a charity ball in Flossen Paradise in a few hours. She has the stones with her. Excellent. More excited. You are fired. Yeah. <laughs> Glad I opened that. <laughs> Hello. Corbin, sweetheart. Hi, Mom. 17 messages. And don't tell me your machine is broken again. Those things are good for 1,000 years. It's a mobile, like a food truck. Yeah, they pull up to the apartment. It's like Uber. Fresh yeah. Uber. Uber Eats. We're almost there. Yeah. So you don't know you want a trip. So flossed in paradise for two for ten days. If I don't want a trip, I'd know about it. Corbin, they've been blaring your name out on the radio for the last hour, you big ape. Who is that? Oh, I'll call you back. That's hey, apartment, Major. Heard you lost your job. I'll get another job. Don't bother. We have one for you. It's like Princess Leia. <laughs> I was trying to figure out. Just one. Why me? I retired six months ago. As a member of the elite special forces unit of the Federated Army, you are an expert in the use of all weapons and spacecraft needed for this mission. He's an expert on all those? Apparently so. All the members of your unit. You're the only one left alive. He's like Rambo. Highly trained, last survivor. Here you Major Iceboard will accompany you as your wife. What? <laughs> <laughs> He knows who she is. Who is it? Um, I haven't seen her face. My yet. wife. You remarried? I just met this girl, but I, I'm going to marry her. I love her, but she hates the military. If she sees you guys here, she's going to kill me. Major, look, just you got to hide somewhere. You got to help me. You just got to hide somewhere. It's just one minute. You see where I'm She's not going to fit in there. The three of us won't fit in there. She will. <laughs> <laughs> Where are they going? Oh, that's cool. The shower lowers down. We heard about your good luck on the radio, and we need your tickets for Florida. You have to save the world, my son. Your ass so you can save the world. <gasps> oh, hope you're not claustrophobic. <laughs> I found him. Mr. Corbin Dallas. Fuck you! Wrong oh, yes, answer. So they haven't even checked and they yeah. think they're done. Oh no. Oh no. Call it Dallas. We got it. Perfect. Zorg really wants them. You have to negotiate. I'm surprised they didn't, um. Oh, I'm so sorry. There's an auto wash in the shower. Many toys today. Both times ended up in my arms. My lucky day. Oh crap! Oh. 
That's how you sleep? Wrapped in cellophane? No, that's when they saran. put them away. Yeah, but why is the saran wrap wrapped around it? Because the bed gets sanitized? I don't I guess, know. I don't know. Well, you must drink a lot of coffee being a priest, huh? <laughs> no, I know, I'm not talking about what I did. What about the military people in the closet? <laughs> oh. I guess they're dead. What is all that? Trash. Go <laughs> on, Devo. <laughs> David is in great shape. To protect you. Collect the stones and meet me at the temple. Okay. Final call for Paradise. What is he wearing? Last call for Flossum Paradise. What is she wearing? Is it the ID, please. Thank you. Mr. Dallas? Uh, Congratulations on winning the contest. Oh, right, okay. Sorry for the mess. Woo! Made it! I was so afraid I wasn't going to make this flight, so I sent uh, David here yeah. to come and pick up my boarding pass. Uh, thank you. Bye. Oh, no. And, uh, this they don't is? look friendly. Little Dallas movie pass. <laughs> Make her too. Oh, David. Quick, Lilo. She's on the plane with Mr. Dallas. I must have it. It's my mission. I should never have given it to you. I know. You incompetent fool. <laughs> it's a ruby ride. It's a thing. It's for him. Sorry, you know. Yes, I'm sure you're very excited, but I'm on my vacation. I don't want to be bothered. Papa Demon! Uh, hi. hi. Unbelievable! What the heck? This is so weird. Yeah. <laughs> God, he's making me dizzy. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not even sure what he's saying. He's talking so fast. How about you? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Ah. His head. <laughs> Corbin Dallas. That's me. I only have one Corbin Dallas on my list, and he's already checked in, okay? I am Corbin Dallas. Sorry, sir. Boarding is spinning. Hey, I need to talk to someone. I don't believe it. It is not an exercise. <laughs> She didn't learn when she was learning the history of the last 5,000 years. Good dreams, Mr. Dallas. Wow. <laughs> what did they give him? Run two, are you operative? Run two. Uh, yeah, everything's ready, Captain. You can have to assume your individual. I don't want one position, I want all positions! <laughs> you thought that was just hair. <laughs> you taken off already? I'm not on the plane. What? I've tried that for so believe me. There's no other way of getting on this plane. Five. And if there is one thing I do not like, it is to be too disappointed. Sorry, sir. This will never happen again. I know. <laughs> I do not want to be disturbed. I know you don't want to be disturbed except if it's Mr. Shadow and it's Mr. Shadow on the line. <laughs> Who's Mr. Shadow? I don't know. My cash have tripled. Money is no importance. Oh! 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 That can't be healthy. I oh. will be among you soon. Oh, we get that checked. <laughs> what the heck is that all about? I don't know, but it's it's it was like. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, we've begun our descent into a flesh and paradise. We will go time at 3:20 p.m. How long were they asleep? Like 15 minutes? Oh no, she's gone. <laughs> kind of has the um, Hawaii feel and a cruise ship feel. Yeah. We have 12 swimming pools and two on the rooftop. Is the diva here yet? Not yet. You have a seat reserved, front row. 
Like the Ruby Rod. <laughs> The mother. Hello? You miserable bastard. I never should have pushed you out. Huh? <laughs> Mothers always find their children. Yeah. What the heck? Welcome to the, uh, I am, uh, security. I have, uh, welcome to the... Wow, he's, uh, so good with words, isn't he? Who is that? I don't know. Miss Platt Laguna wants you to know how glad she is that you're here. She'll give you what you've come to get after the concert. Stay here. Oh, so she had sensed her, sensed her there? I guess so. We were out at the for two hours with nasty covered and the manager is so fucking no doubt. I want to make myself a ponytail like that. <laughs> <laughs> and here we have Roy Von Baker, King of Lazerball. Right now it's time for Carver to say the word of the day. You happy here? Uh, That's not going to be who he thinks it is. Yeah. Is that the really tall girl? I think so. Seems a bit sad. Oh my god, look at her hair. Yeah, people behind her are like, dang it! <laughs> <laughs> In the front row too. Yeah, <laughs> blocking like three rows behind her. She looks like somebody in Star Wars. Yeah. Commander, I have a ship in trouble. Requesting permission to dock for repairs. Permission granted for one hour. More than I need. That's in for the diva. I'll take it. How do you know? Yeah, open it this time. <laughs> well, we don't really want them to open it, right? But. Oh man, she just headbutted that dude. Oh yeah, she learned martial arts. Mm hmm. Yeah, why didn't they shoot to begin with? They're not going to be in there. It was an ambush. How many were there? One. <laughs> Bravo! Bravo. My cop was a little late. And I'll stop. <laughs> He's still not hitting her. <laughs> contained all in that area, why are they pulling them out? I don't know. Let's jump the beat. We got big teeth and we got big foreheads and big ears and they stink. <laughs> they stink. They've had a stunt. Who? The fifth element. Really? Yes. Yeah. She needs your help. And your love. But where are the elements? How badly is she shot? Looks like she was shot. If you want something done, do it yourself. But he didn't look in the box either. Yeah. The stones, where are the stones? They're not in this box. <laughs> well, apparently they are. No way. No, he's laughing because they're not in there. <laughs> <laughs> in you? Uh huh. Where's the other? Ruby, hold this gun. What would I do? If you move, squeeze the trigger. In me. Oh. Mm. Okay.
Okay. Ruby. Uh-oh. Oh my God, coming. Another one coming. Oh, shit, three coming, coming. It needs to be quiet. Yeah. Come on. Is that your idea of a discreet operation? Don't worry, sir. He'll calm things down. Even with all these bullets, these guys can't hit anything. I'm gonna go and try to see if I can see something a little closer. <laughs> yeah, like stormtroopers. Pinhead. <laughs> oh, don't shoot! Oh my god. I'm on vacation! Wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, because it was uh, like a seesaw. Yeah. yeah. Don't move. Huh? Count two. Ten. <laughs> he does scream like a girl. Yeah. He's so annoying. <laughs> Oh, he's only got 10 more minutes. Is he going back? You were charged? Yeah. I'm going to out there. Seven on the left, five on the right. We need to find the leader. Mangalores won't fight without the leader. That's the leader. You mind if I try? No, no, sure, sure. We're sending somebody in to negotiate! Anybody else want to negotiate? Where did he learn to negotiate like that? I wonder. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Where's the fifth element? I don't know. It's still from the ceiling, bleeding to death? I don't know that I am fighting for a noble cause. Yes, you're trying to save the world. Right now I'm trying to save Lulu, Father. Hey, Lou. <laughs> These are wasting a lot of seconds. For security reasons, the hotel must be evacuated. Where are they gonna go? Lifeboats. Two minutes to complete the evacuation. Guess he doesn't care. Oh jeez. Oh wow, that was close. Where are the stones? I think they have them. <laughs> <laughs> and he's just gonna know how to drive it. Well, he he knows how to use everything. Remember? Right. Get out the door! How are we gonna get out the door? gonna turn it off yeah i hope so he's gonna deactivate it right because he knows how to do that taking it pretty slow that's for sure Six. Five. <laughs> what happened they have bomb too fix up at five <laughs> Did get out, maybe? Yeah, ma sort of. <sighs> and 
priest is guiding them directly to the temple. With faith. He's not the actual president, I bet you. Well, you think he's one of those shape-changing guys? Yeah. Maybe. You said that I should take care of you. You got your romance, babe. Don't say I don't deliver. <laughs> it's not only advancing, it's moving at incredible speed. We're having trouble following it. And do you have any idea where it's heading? <laughs> Corp, there's a general on the uh, phone. Major Dallas. I first would like to salute a warrior. Any yeah, idea when you're going to be getting to the point? There's a ball of fire, 1,200 miles in diameter, heading straight for Earth. How much time do we have? In an hour and 57 minutes. I'll call you back in two hours. <laughs> Why does she want to learn about that? Human nature. It's so sad. They just landed in the desert. Put on your pencil. Stone should go around. The fifth element should be in the middle. And then the weapon against evil should work. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's it. Match up the symbols. Go! Go! Win. Fire. So what happens now? We have to open them. I think yeah, I do that. Right? Theoretically? No. No. <laughs> Not even in theory. <laughs> hey, wake up, buddy. Wake up. You have to help us. How do you open these stones? We need blood. Wind blows, fire burns. Rain falls. There's one more. Yeah, oh, they're right here. No. Kept pushing it down. There. Oh yeah, push them down at the same time. Corbin. He blew on it. <sighs> and I said, uh, we're not going to make it. And then you blew. Yeah, the wind blows. I said wind, wind blows. What is earth though? Earth. Oh, dirt, dirt. There you go. What's that one? Fiery. You need to burn it. Let's get the one out left. Down. Nobody breathe. Yeah. <laughs> Taking too long, dude. Wake up! It's time for you to work now. I know you're very tired. I'll take you on a vacation when we're done. I swear. But listen, if you don't do something right now, we're all gonna die. Love, love. Love. Oh. Love. You're right. You're right. But there are, there are some things, very nice things we're saving, some beautiful things. Love. Love. Yes, yes, love. That's good. That's good. That's Love. You're wrong, you're wrong, you're wrong. I need you. Why? Because. Tell her, uh, Corbin. Please, you need me. I love you. Three, two, one. Killer? 
Tja. Wow, he's really sweating it. <laughs> yeah. I knew it would work. Oh. I think she's dead. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> Where's he going? Oh, did they rebuild her from her genetics? I don't know. Where are my two heroes? Oh, well, they were so tired from their ordeal, we put them in the reactor this morning. I have 19 more minutes after this one, Professor. 19. We go live in one minute, Mr. President. Mm -hmm. There. <laughs> you have 20 seconds. No, oh, no, I tried. No, man. Who's that? A woman. Claims to be Corbin's mother. <laughs> Mrs. Dallas. This is the president. I would like to thank oh, you. Please. That doesn't even sound like him. The president's an idiot. You don't sound like an idiot. <laughs> well, I'll just throw myself in traffic. I'll just saran wrap myself in the bed for some time. Okay. <laughs> okay, that was the fifth element. What did you think? That was great. That was great? Yeah. That was a good You movie. got your romance. You didn't even That's expect right. it, right? No. Nope. All right. That's cool. So we're, I was not expecting a romance. I mean, I joked in the intro that maybe it's a rom-com. I don't think it was a comedy. I mean, it had, had some funny parts to it, but it wasn't, comedy definitely wasn't the, the main thing. But I was surprised it was a romance. Yeah. So. It was good. It was fun. Favorite part? Any favorite character? Bruce Willis is always great. Yeah, he was good. Um, I did have a hard time believing that Lilu didn't learn English. I mean, she learned everything else over the past 5,000 years up to the letter V and hadn't learned English yet. That was kind of weird. Remember when she was going through all the stuff? Well, she was trying to learn everything that was... Yeah, or all history. Yeah. And she hadn't, but she, she didn't learn English to talk to the people around her. Yeah. She could learn that quickly, and she just didn't do it. It was just, I thought it was kind of weird. Like, hmm, okay. It was an I odd choice. I yeah, I don't know. thought maybe get the language down first, but... What did you think of Chris Tucker, the DJ? <laughs> I know, he was a little crazy. A little yeah, it was, it was funny for a short amount of time, and then it just got very annoying. Like, oh, can somebody please just... <laughs> it was weird. Yeah. yeah. All right. Anything else you want to say? Nope. All right. Well, if you enjoyed this reaction, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, comment down below. Let us know what you thought of The Fifth Element. Uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. And if you would like to see a full-length reaction to this and everything else that we've reacted to, we'll put the link to our Patreon down below. And we will see you next time. Bye. Bye-bye.